How much on the He-Man, mate? It's a different one. I hate that. $130 for the bag. Would you, um, would you consider 100 So that was a huge risk. I've never spent $100 on some action figures, but in today's flea market video, it's exactly what we've done. There's a little bit more on that story later in the video, but ultimately today, guys, we're trying to find stuff to flip onto eBay for a profit. It's a really big morning today. We found a heap of items, so let's get into the flea and I'll show you what I'm picking up. That's a good one. This is a good board game. Oh, really? Yeah. Uh, oh, well, that's your game. How much on the board game? Is it, you know the price? Yeah. Uh, 15. $15. Would you do 10? Three. Ten? Ten? Yeah, All right. No worries. Uh, <laughs> Thank you. I'll take the 10 off you. Thank you very much. Appreciate that. 15. 15. Thank you. Yeah. Oh, um, netball. Netball? Yeah. 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 Souls aren't the worst. How much on the board game? Five bucks? All right, I'll take that. There you go. That's ours. Yeah. Thank you very much. To, uh, I'll just check that one. How much on the video game? 25 on that one? All right. Give me your towels dry. Want any more toys, mate? No, not much. Sorry, I didn't need to. Yeah, you collect the other ones and stuff. How much DVDs? DVDs are all buck each, buddy. A dollar? I'll take that one. from Nintendo yeah. Benson's I think I have to check this I think it is the same really the same um, what's it called as your other one yeah that's sick <laughs> how cool is that <laughs> how much you got on him 10 10 yeah Oh, mate, I think you should go. If that's a hundred bucks, that's with the Is it Benson's? Um, yeah, I'm going to go. Go get it. How much? How much you offering me? No, I remember this game. I remember this game. No, I want you to start it. I want you to get me get me going. Ninety-two dollars. Ninety-two. There you go. Can I bring yeah. you down lower? You can. <laughs> <laughs> well, I can see a ten on those. Which ones? Yeah, those are tens. Yeah, how much on these? How much? How much? These and you. Oh, that's twelve bucks. Twelve. How about ten, and I'll do it for you. All right. Oh, that that see that was easy. I knew you were gonna say. Yeah. That. <laughs> and I'm happy with that. That's good. Oh, really? How much are they? Thank you, Thank you very much. Much appreciated. No worries. I'll see you next week. Oh, you certainly will. <laughs> I don't miss. Hello, mate. 
Thanks, man. Watch your videos. Oh, good yeah, man. How are you? Yeah, I caught you last week. You were filming your couch row at the back of your van, so I didn't want to interrupt you. Oh, <laughs> yeah, <laughs> mate. No, I appreciate it. How are you? Yeah, Doing well? Yeah, good to see you. Do you come here often? Um, I used to years ago. Yeah. Um, but, um, yeah, I've been travelling for a bit. So, nice. yeah, last week was my first week back. Oh, sick. Got a few good things. But, yeah. yeah, good to have you back. This Same is definitely thing. the spot. I love coming here each week. Yeah, it's every Sunday. Sunday. Yeah. Try and do all the other ones. Just check them out. But yeah. this is a staple. Yeah. You don't need this one. Yeah. 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 No, it's good, mate. Oh, good luck, man. Thanks, Thanks mate. Yeah, Appreciate yeah, it. Yeah, good to meet you. Me. Cheers. Yeah, right. Just here. Cool. I think that's actually one there. Oh yeah, oh yeah. It's a, it's a good racket. Yeah, true. But yeah. Tour series. Yeah. Legend, mate. How do you get them um, you just go um, butchers and bubble. Yeah. What do you get? Um... You got good rackets, hey? Not very good. What's the story behind these? Oh, you just don't want them anymore. Was playing, he was playing, was he? And they're both the exact same, are they? Yes. Yeah. And your best price? How much? I said forty each. Forty each. Um, I'd probably be more like two for fifty. Two for fifty. Yeah. You had an offer for two for seventy? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Maybe come back. Um, yeah, it's tricky. Would you do one for 40? Yeah. Just the one for 40? Yeah. Oh, I'll do that. I'll take one. Um, all right, let me go get some cash. We'll do two for 60 then. Oh, all right. Yeah, yeah, I'll get you some cash. Thanks. No worries. Thank you. Appreciate that. Thanks, guys. Oh, there. Legend. Thanks, man. Yeah. Hey, man. This guy knows. Yeah, individually, you're looking at like 30 to 50 bucks. That guy? Is he 175? What I saw is that, like, with the accessories in here. The one with, like, the bendy legs and stuff are different as well. Oh, the rotation. Yeah. Yeah, he's all over the place. Maybe what do you reckon? I reckon this guy here is probably pretty interesting. Yeah, dude, he's sick. I don't know who he is. Nah. Oh, it'd be a gamble, yeah, hey? It would be, yeah. Jeez, it's so tempting, though. It's just not, it's not normally my category, you know? But they're just so sick. Appreciate you showing me, man. What if we split this? Yeah. Well, would you do it? Yeah. Yeah? If, if we could do it. You'd be happy with that, though? Yeah. All right. Let's see what we can do. How much on the He-Man, mate? 130 for the bag. Would you um, would you consider a hundred? I'll do it for a hundred. I wouldn't do anything. I wouldn't go any higher. Good job. How are you? Follow the rules, Dad. You wouldn't go any higher. I wouldn't go any higher. Okay, I'm thinking. Hundred bucks? Yeah. yeah. Okay. Thanks, mate. Appreciate that. Nice part. We got. So what are we talking? Thirty to forty on the uh, skeletons. Thirty to forty. Um, and then same on the humans because they're a little bit harder to find. Thirty to forty. We've got around 90 on this dude. Now show me what he cool. did. He's got like a little neck, neck pops out. And not all of these have that. No, so I think he's a rarer one it seems. Okay. We've got around 30 to 40 on this dude. He's missing a couple of accessories. Otherwise it'd be worth more like 70. Okay. And then um, around 40 on this guy too. He's, he's pretty neat. I thought he was worth more to be honest. But, okay, so that's say um, 70 there. We've got about 70. That's 90. 90 and then we've got 60 on each of those. So and 120 there. 120 there. So yeah, if we're going to uh, split them, you would go... That, yeah. that, yeah. And, and then, then one, one each, one each. That's a pretty easy split. Yep. Let's do that. All right, so Jamie and I, we're going to go and cruise over to this big red shed that you can see up here um, to get these He-Men evaluated. We want to know in a toy shop 
how much they think they're worth. So let's go in and maybe we could even sell them. Yeah. Look at that. We buy old toys. Well, do you want some 1981 He-Man? <laughs> let's see what we can do. G'day, mate. Hey, mate. How you going? Oh, yeah, really well. We were curious. We've got these toys. Yeah. And I know you could have missed this. Yeah. Just wanted to get your thoughts on how much they might be worth. Yeah. If, do you want to sell them or do you want to keep them? We're just curious on price initially. Right. So that's a uh, bear. So their bodies are slightly different. So I think that's a. Um, it's an original. Yep. I think that belt's it's the, an 80, 81. That belt's for him. This one, I think, is a little bit newer. Not newer, newer, but it's still vintage. Yep. It's, um, oh, I should not have told my head. I mean, He Man's my thing. So, oh, really? Oh, dude, I've got the entire set. You're a He Man man. box and everything. <laughs> yeah, that's dude. it. Yeah. Um, oh, but, that's good. We're coming to the right man then. Two Thunder Punch He Man's. Yep. Beast Man with um, wrong armor. He's got Weapon Spike armor. That's that's just a bear figure. So, bear figures, 15 bucks. Yep. Those. You'd get probably 30, 40 bucks for okay. Skelly. Yep. Same deal as him. His belt's probably about 10 bucks. Yep. Um, for the belt itself is 10. Yeah, belt itself is 10. Sick. Thunder Punch, he means. There's no weapons on those, so you probably get 30 bucks a piece for those. 30, yep. Uh, you got. Um, He's got a long neck. Brown neck, uh, normal neck, rat wall. Yep. He's probably about. 50, 60 bucks? 50, 60. Yeah. Okay. And this guy, who is he? Oh, that's Grizzlaw. Okay. That's Wave 1 Grizzlaw. Yeah. We did have a date on him, that was the only thing. I wasn't sure. Oh, he's early 80s. He early did his 80s. first release. First so release. Be, yeah, I think he's 81, 82, I think. Somewhere yeah. There. What do you reckon he'd be worth? Uh, with his thing, probably 30 bucks, 40 bucks. 30, 40. Yep. Yeah, I, if I was to. You, you want say, to sell say, them? Say you're going to say you're gonna purchase the whole lot. So I was going to buy them in one lot. Um, I would give you. Uh, 100, 100, 10, 160. Dude, I'll do you 200 bucks for more. 200? Yep. Okay. That's, that's a pretty reasonable price. That's not bad. None of them have weapons, except for rat wall, but that's a pretty common weapon. That's really good to know, though, man. Yeah. Um, we're, we've only just arrived, so we're going to mm -hmm. have a coffee and have a think about it. But mate, 200, that's actually a fair, Sweetos, mate, that's that's a pretty, a fair that's offer. That's a pretty fair offer. Oh, I'm pretty not even, I don't even think I'd negotiate with that. I yeah. think that's... It's just whether or not we want to get rid of him. Yeah, for sure. Good Sweet. man. Much appreciated. Awesome. Um, okay, so we've been offered we've been offered two hundred bucks. Yeah. And you were just mentioning that you think that two hundred actually might be a fair price because of fees and postage. I reckon we wouldn't be looking at really much more than that at all. Because you've got to think about it, if they are thirty to fifty dollars each and there was seven of them in total. Yeah. So seven in total at thirty to fifty. Even so it's basically top dollar at seven two fifty. You would have to sell them for about three hundred bucks to probably get that same result. Yeah. Well, where we can get two hundred cash right now and double our money. Yeah. I think the only reason is he can get a premium because he's a store where we have to go and want the selling for exactly online. And we have to wait for them all to sell. Exactly. So we got we got to wait for sell inventory, through inventory, all this sort of stuff, keep them in storage. Do the listing. Yep. Versus but, literally doubling our money right now. Got to clean them possibly as well. Got it's to quite clean a lot of work. Them. Plus, we're splitting this deal as well, Jamie and I. Yeah. So the fact that we can literally double our money right now on the spot. Yeah. Do you want to do it? I think the only other thing we could do yeah. is possibly a store credit sort of thing. A store if there's credit. something in there that we think we could that he's got underpriced already, you never know. So you're thinking we go in there with 200 bucks to, to play with? Or <laughs> we say, hey, if you let us buy it in store. Would you do 250 of store credit rather oh, than 250. 200 of cash? But then, how is your skill base to be able to capitalize on? This is what I'm saying. Yeah. So it might be worth it, it might not. We'll see. Could be but a risk. Worst comes to worst, we come out of it with 100 bucks profit if we can't. Oh, so you're saying have a look around with yeah. store credit? And yeah. if not, and if not take at least cash. we take the cash. Okay, let's go do that. All right, let's have a look. Phew. So that was a really clever idea from Jamie to have a bit of a look around the store to see if we could further increase the profits that we're already set to make. And this store really did have everything from vintage toys to video games, you name it, this guy had it. But the price points were pretty tricky to try and match up on eBay to find any form of profit. We had a continued further look around and we actually found the toys that we were trying to sell ourselves and the price points weren't too indifferent to what he was offering us. So we quickly realized that it was a really good deal and that we should probably go ahead and commit to the cash payment. 
I just know that they're old and they're probably worth a bit. Yeah, dude, 200 bucks. Oh, man. Sweet. I appreciate that, mate. Cool. All the best. Sweet. All right, guys. Well, Jamie, my friend, take your 100. There you go. That's how you double your money at the flea. Might be the quickest double of our money we've ever had, my friend. Well done. Well done. So there you go, guys. Uh, pretty cool uh, to run into the flea market, find some items, take a bit of a risk and then turn $100 into $200. A really quick shout out, obviously to Jamie himself. I mean, he's a lot more you know, knowledgeable on the toy game than I am. And um, it was really his confidence to go in at 50-50 uh, with me on that deal was uh, basically allowed it to happen really. I don't think I would have spent $100 if it was just myself. So a big thank you to him. And the other one as well was Dinesh. Um, Dinesh was in the video. I never introduced him on camera, but he was a large part of the flea market visit. He watches the videos and he bumped into me and he said hello, but um, he, he actually pointed out the He-Man and said, you might want to have a look at it for some content. Um, and he also pointed out the tennis rackets that I went ahead and purchased as well. So really kind and generous. Um, could have gone ahead with the purchase himself, but well, um, yeah, went and passed on the information to me as well. So um, hopefully, Dinesh, if you're watching, thank you very much, mate. I really do appreciate your support. And that's how cool this community is. So many people trying to help each other out. It's, it's really, really cool to see. So really fun video, guys. Hopefully you've enjoyed it. Remember to hit the like button if you did. And uh, remember to subscribe to the channel. I do these flea market videos every single Sunday and I'm just going to keep doing it because I had too much fun doing it. Um, appreciate you being here, guys. My 30% clubbers, stick around to the end. You guys are the best. We'll see you next week on Tuesday for a bit of what's sold. See you soon.